13 year old boy from North Dakota survived a nearly 100 foot fall from the north rim of the Grand Canyon. First responders risked their own safety to save the teenager. Now the boy is talking about how it all happened. ABC's Janae Norman has his reaction. Falling nearly 100 feet over the side of a cliff into the Grand Canyon and this morning living to tell the harrowing story. I almost died. I was like inches away from death at that time. 13-year-old Wyatt Kaufman was vacationing with his mom, Carol, as they explored the Bright Angel Point. Taking pictures with my cell phone and my camera, and then I went all the way up, all the way up onto the very top of the point, and it's flat out there, and you can see the entire canyon. It is beautiful up there. He says as other visitors came and went getting their own pictures, he was trying to stay out of the way when he slipped and tumbled down. Once they were getting up and they were done with the picture, and I kind of stood up, I lost my grip, and that's when I started to fall back. I cannot remember anything past that point. High winds making a helicopter rescue impossible. So search and rescue crews resorting to using ropes and a Stokes basket to reel the teen back to safety. Lucky to be alive. A 44-year-old man died after accidentally falling 200 feet in the same area a year ago, which is notoriously narrow. The Grand Canyon, the scene of nearly 80 over-the-edge incidents in the last decade. And that was ABC's Janae Norman reporting. Wyatt is now on his way home to North Dakota. He says he's grateful to the park rangers and first responders who helped to save his life.